You want to reel it? Yeah. All right, reel it. Reel it, reel it, reel it. Oh, a shark. It's a shark. What's up everybody? Welcome to another fish head video. We're headed to Hilton Head, South Carolina for an awesome adventure. Got the van packed up. The whole fish head fam is here. We're on our way. We should be there in like five hours. Four hours into a five hour drive and we hit traffic, guys. We are going slow. One time, years ago, I got stuck on 95 still for four hours. I actually ended up getting out of my truck, putting the tailgate down, and playing the guitar on my tailgate for like an hour and a half, waiting for an accident to clear. Hopefully this one's not like that, because we want to get to Hilton Head and start this adventure. We had to make a quick stop at Walmart, guys, stock up on a few things. Leaders, hooks, weights. I looked for fish bites, but they don't have the same type of fish bites that we have in Florida. So I'm just gonna forget about the fish bites for now. We did grab a cast net, so we can try to cast net for some mullet. Maybe we can use some live bait. I don't know about you guys, but every time we come to Walmart, we end up spending like 300 bucks on a bunch of stuff we didn't come for. It always happens. Yes, we made it. Woohoo! Woo oh yeah. Too bad you're not sleeping on that bed. Ha <laughs> ha You can't get me off. Looking nice. Got a little splash pad. A little tiki hut bar and grill. The pool right there, and the Atlantic Ocean past that, and the kitchen. Hopefully we can catch some fish. They have grills downstairs we can use. If we don't feel like using those, we got a full kitchen to use. Sweet. Good morning, fish heads. Day one, it just got light out. Dylan's up and ready. We're gonna go catch some fish. Looks like we weren't the only ones that had this idea, guys. We have to walk down the beach. Absolutely gorgeous morning out here, guys. Got the rods rigged and baited. We're ready to catch some fish. There's a couple boats out here right in front of us, so we might have picked a really good spot here. Dylan's trying to catch some bait with the cast net. Lucas is just digging in the sand. Conditions are great right now, guys. Hardly any surf at all. It is so calm. The tide is about to come in. So the next couple hours should be perfect, perfect surf fishing. Oh, look what Dylan got. Let's see it, dude. Oh, yeah. Nice. A jack. Yep. Good catch, dude. Oh, that's a fish. A little bit of chicken on the grill for day one of the adventure. 
Got some Cajun salt and pepper and some garlic salt. So we're sitting here on this bench playing some Pokemon and this cicada just climbs up on my leg. Look at this guy. All right guys, day two of the adventure. We realized yesterday that we had too much stuff to try to carry it and we're going further today. So we decided to pick up this blue cart. It's making life a lot easier for us. So let's head down there and see if we can't make this happen today. Dylan got a big old blue crab in the cast net, but it's a female, so we're gonna let her go. Pretty awesome though. Whiting. Got a little whiting, guys. We got one of these earlier off camera. Finally got this little guy on camera. He's so small, we're not gonna try to keep him though. Dylan cut himself, I gotta go check out what's going on. If you guys have watched a bunch of our other videos, you know that Dylan cuts himself all the time when we go fishing. He takes his shoes off and steps on something sharp. It has happened again. So we just loaded up the stuff on the cart. We're gonna go head back, get his foot taken care of, and then we'll continue the adventure after that. So. Little break in the day here. We need some band-aids. We made it back. Dylan's foot is fine. It was just a little scratch, really. But the beach is getting really, really crowded. So we're gonna wait and fish again later this evening. If you guys are enjoying the video so far, make sure you hit that like button. Do it, do it, hit the button. This place is really awesome. They've got this little rock garden and a pool garden all around it. Lucas, is that a big frog? A splash pad, a slide. We're about to go on the slide. I'll video that. That's going to be really cool. Great looking place though. Lucas is going to go on the water slide. Up and up and up. Shark Shoals Slide. And after going through the tube, he's gonna come all the way down here out the bottom. Come on, come on Lucas. Yay. Good job, dude. Was that fun? Was it fun? I didn't go really far. I kinda got stuck right at the end. Oh, uh, well that looked really cool, dude. All right. Dad, can you come this time? Yeah, I'm gonna come. I can't let Lucas do this without me doing it too. One's going too. Check out these giant koi. They're huge. Wow, these guys are like over two feet long. Big old koi. Oh, there's an orange one coming. There he is. Dylan's koi are babies compared to these guys. We decided not to go fishing tonight, so we're playing chess. Lucas, <laughs> where's your headband, buddy? I made mine different. Oh, some aliens. Day three, guys. Day three of the Hilton Head Island adventure. 
It's not as sunny today. There's a lot more current and a little bit more wind. But we're gonna try it again and see what we can do. Nice. Shark tooth. In the net. Nice, buddy. That's a good start. Let's see if we can catch some fish, too. Today we're trying something just a little bit different. We're tipping the hooks with fish bites. Maybe add a little bit more scent to the shrimp we're using for bait. Lost it on the first cast on this hook already. I'm gonna go ahead and re-rig it. That's what we're using. Dylan got the first one of the day, whiting. What is it? What is it? A shark. Shark. Can't catch those here, so we're just gonna let them go. Another whiting. Another whiting, guys. Much bigger this time. We're gonna be able to catch and cook. All right, guys, we're back. We're gonna make a fried whiting sandwich. We're gonna see what we can do here with limited resources, but I think it's gonna be awesome. Just need one egg. We'll do an egg wash and then a batter. We're gonna go ahead and use the Louisiana New Orleans style fish fry. Banana eating monkey. Lucas is gonna help us fry this and he'll be able to taste it too. You pumped, dude? Yep. Yeah. All right, so we'll put the flays, egg wash, batter. That's going to be the order of it. <laughs> so you want to pick up your filet, get it all soaked with the egg wash on both sides, and then you put it in the batter, get it all covered with batter real good. Hopefully we don't set off the smoke detector while we're doing this. All right, now we can go ahead and drop them in the oil. Oh no, guys, we did set off the smoke detector. They're going to be coming for us. So that was crazy. We got the alarm off. <laughs> now we're going to be able to cook. These flays are looking great. I'm going to go ahead and throw them in the oil now. Yeah, we're just cooking. Cooking. Yeah, it's like it's all good. Yep. Cool, cool. Appreciate yeah. it. How's it going? Ooh, that looks perfect. Oh, that's looking amazing. Taste test time. Give Lucas a piece of the sandwich. I'll take the other piece. Cheers, buddy. We'll see how good this is. Amazing. You like it? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, good stuff, guys. So day three has been amazing so far, guys. We're also gonna go to Giuseppe's restaurant, go try out some Italian food. We got the fish head fam with us. Let's go eat. Made it to Giuseppe's. See what we got here. We got the last table at Giuseppe's, guys. The very end table. so good he loves it it's so good do it okay three two one 
Chop it. Yes. 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 <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, Fishhead fam, it's day four now. Day four of the Hilton Head Island Adventure. Yesterday was pretty awesome. It's going to be hard to beat that, but we're going to try it. Dylan's already doing the cast net. I got the rods rigged up, ready to cast out. Let's see if we can't catch something cool today. Check this out guys, two whiting, two at the same time. Oh yeah. What? Stingray. Getting some bites. Both rods. A shark and a whiting? A shark and a whiting. Shark. Whiting. The next fish can I reel in? Sure, buddy. You want to reel it? Yeah. All right, reel it. Reel it, reel it, reel it. It's a shark. <laughs> a sharky. Can we eat him? Just snapped off trying to take that cast, so we're gonna call it. Fish with one rod for just a few more minutes and then we'll call it a day. Not gonna do much fishing over here. T-bone night. Grampy fish head is treating everyone to some T-bones. So every grill is taken right now. We have to wait a minute. Dylan doesn't want to wait. Dylan, Dylan, just letting the grill get up to the proper heat. We got a shrimp fest over here. We got a sausage fest over here. It's looking great. Four minutes on each side. How good does that look? We're gonna make one more effort today. At least take some casts. Grampy fish head. Woo! Whiting. I've seen a fish exactly like that before at Panama City Beach. And he swam away. What is this, guys? Comment below. What kind of fish is that? Day five of the Hilton Head Adventure, guys. We changed it up a little bit. No fishing this morning. We played some golf. But instead, we're going to make black beans and rice and some amazing Cuban-style pork butt. Can never go wrong with peppers and onions. Base ingredients. Beans are going in. Addie has about 12 pounds of towel on her head right now. I'm cold. It looks pretty warm. Dylan has a koala on his head. That's not a koala, that's a kangaroo. A kangaroo. <laughs> the pork is ready. Look at this. Wow. That's going to be some good pork. The pork just falls away perfectly. The whole fish head fam's here. We're about to eat this delicious looking feast. All right, guys, we got to try out the Waboba Big Kahuna Ball. This thing bounces on water. It's going to be awesome. We're going to try it out right now. We'll bounce it around Addy. If you guys want to find out more about the Waboba Ball, check the link below. What's up, fish heads? Day six 
the Hilton Head Island Adventure. We're heading out pretty early this morning. We're gonna go down the beach, see if we can't catch some more fish. Mama Fish Head's gonna be doing some shark toothing. But I think the whiting are gonna definitely be fighting because we have the perfect time and tide. So let's go do this. We've been here for like two minutes and Dylan already found a couple of awesome looking hermit crabs. Check these guys out. Dylan got a blue crab. Oh, it's not a keeper. A little too small. We'll let that guy go. Try to get a bigger one. We got zero fish over there by the jetty. So we're gonna move down to the beach. There's a little point down here, about a half a mile away. We're just gonna go there and try it out for a little while. Then after we're fishing, we'll go back and shower up and do some island exploring. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, it's big. It's big. I don't know what we got. It does not feel like a whiting. Woo! Oh, it's running hard. It's running hard. Woo! We have Yes! Winner. Woo! Oh yeah. These guys fight so hard. So hard. Awesome fish to catch. Dude, nice. Another one. Woo! Oh yeah. Well guys, we made it back. Hey, hummingbird. Back to good old North Florida. Beautiful North Florida with the hummingbirds. That was an awesome adventure, guys. Love Hilton Head Island. We're definitely going back probably every year from now on. Love adventures like that. Fishing, hanging out with the family, having a great time all around. Everything was awesome about it, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did enjoy it, go ahead and hit that like button. Do it. Do it. Hit the like button. <laughs> Let us know what other adventures you want to see us do. You can email us, comment below, whatever. We're willing to go anywhere if we can do it. If we can make it happen, we want to make it happen. But thank you guys so much for watching this video. We had a ton of fun making it. Hope you had a ton of fun watching it. And thank you for watching all of our videos, guys. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button. See all the new adventures that we're gonna do. We've got a bunch of them lined up. We've actually got a really cool camp boat build series about to get started here. Maybe this weekend if we can do it. But thanks a lot guys. We'll see you in the next one.